Good morning, Bob Squad. Oh, man. Dana Life of a Boxer. Let's get started with it. Let's do it. All right, y'all. Just got out the bed. I'm going to brush my teeth. Um, and then I'm going to get dressed and get ready on my uh, run. I normally always run in the morning. If I don't run in the morning, I run later in the day, but... Yeah, let's just get right to it. Alright guys, just got done brushing my teeth. Ugh. So I'm going this run, y'all. Let's do it. Okay, so now you guys, I'm gonna be massaging my foot because I woke up this morning and it hurts pretty bad. And to go on this run and to be able to complete this run, I will need to massage it 100%. So I got this massage gun. And basically what I'm gonna do is just massage it for like five to 10 minutes and then go on this run because it is very essential to make sure that your body feels right before you work out. So let's get on, let's get on to that massaging. Let's do it. Hey, right, I'm massaging my foot right now. I got the gun. And you know, my mom's right here. Hey, say hi, mom. Yeah, I tell her hi. Hey, y'all heard it? Y'all heard what's going on? Oh, yo. Hey, how y'all doing? Good morning. Get my coffee on. Hey, y'all heard it? Y'all heard it? <laughs> I know y'all love her so much. So, you know, I got to put her on the channel, man. You know, we up in early. We up early. What, 6.30, mom? Yep. Yep. This is the boxing mom right here. Get up and grind. Gotta yep. Get up and grind. Gotta get up and grind. Y'all yeah, yeah, heard it. Y'all know. It ain't easy. It ain't easy. God bless y'all in the mighty name of Jesus. Y'all heard it, man. Y'all heard it. God bless y'all. Good morning. <laughs> yeah, we just massaging my foot right now. Uh, getting it massaged up for this run. You know. My leg massage too because yesterday I got like a shin splint when I was on my run. It literally was just the worst run possible. So I'm trying to get a redemption today. Hopefully, you guys, I can get a redemption and get a good run in today. Um, but we gonna see what's gonna happen. So let's do it. All right, guys, just got done with massaging. I guess we're ready to go. My foot is still not feeling the best, so we're gonna try to go on a three mile as I said before. But if it's too bad and I'm hurting too bad, we might have to cut it short. But I'm going to try to get this three-mile run on here for y'all just to show you guys how it works, how I do it. So, yeah. Just got done massaging. About to head on out. All right, y'all. I'll see you guys on the run. Peace. All right, y'all. We out on this run. And my foot it still hurts. But I'm a veteran runner, and I know how to baby one foot while using the other. So what I'll do is put a lot more pressure on my left foot. Use my right foot just for stabilizing me. It's a perfect weather outside. You want to get out in the morning because in the morning, it's nice and cool. There's no sun outside and the air is a lot cleaner. The air is a lot thinner. <laughs> running with a running with a messed up ankle man hurts. I mean, if y'all watch my I mean if you, you guys are on my Instagram, you guys know I run half of marathons. So three miles ain't none for me. It's just my dang ankle. Yeah, I think my real loyal subscribers know I run half of marathons. So, y'all know everything is light work. So, yeah. All right, y'all. See y'all at a half a mile.
How are y'all? All right, y'all. Half a mile. Really, the first mile is a warm up, and then the other two miles are at a good pace. But yeah, it's a half a mile, y'all. I'll see you at a mile, okay? <laughs> Alright y'all, well my land, I feel good. I feel good. Um my right foot's starting to feel a little bit better. That's good, right? You know, the mile is always the warm-up, as I said before. And then the two other miles are like a realization you're running. So I'm gonna try to speed it up these next two miles. But yeah, y'all. I'll see you guys at um, let's make it two miles. How about that? I like to say I'm gonna drop my socials down in the description. You guys, please, please follow. I'm trying to get my socials up too. Um, it mean a lot. Thank you guys. See you at mile two. Peace. All right, guys, mile two. I feel good. I'm starting to warm up. Like I told you guys, mile one is just a warm up. Mile two and three is a realization. And I'm starting to warm up and I'm getting faster and faster. My foot feels okay. And you know, that's how it works in a run. Sometimes you gotta just start so you can finish. Pro tip from a veteran runner. <laughs> Two and a half miles, guys. I feel great. I feel great. Um, this is a feeling you get when you run. It's amazing. But yeah, y'all. Two and a half miles. I'll see you at three. Let's finish strong. All right, guys, that's three miles. Some light today. You know, just have some light in the morning because, you know, on my birthday, I gained a lot of weight. So I can't run that far because of uh, my legs. If I run too long on them, they'll start to hurt because I gained like 10 pounds. <laughs> but uh, yeah, yeah, that's three, that's, uh, three miles. Um, I showed you guys that I was in a lot of pain in the beginning, but I finished strong and and I feel better. I feel great. Um, I'm ready to go on another run. Shoot. I'll probably go on another run today. We'll see how I'm feeling. As you guys will see, my training regimen, it's built around my school schedule. So I can't really do training all the, all the time, but I train at least two times or three times a day. Uh, you know, just staying ready so I don't have to get ready. Uh, you know, because I'm planning on having a fight soon. Uh, probably uh, October, definitely October. Uh, I mean, September's really up. So we're going to plan for October. And uh, yeah, 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 y'all. Bomb Squad, uh, I love y'all. I'll see you guys back at the crib. And y'all see what I do after a run, how to recover, how to stay uh, pain-free. Well, y'all just seen I was in pain, so I guess don't listen to my advice, but 
when I get home, I'll stretch and uh, massage myself, take a shower, and then eat breakfast. Uh, yeah, let's uh, get on to that, guys. Also, you guys, I like to cool down with a walk. You know, just walk around, get your get your lactic acid out of your legs, and um, is that? Hold on, if that's what it is, you guys, that's what it is. But if I'm wrong, don't laugh at me. But pretty sure it's lactic acid. Um, walking helps it. it. Walking helps your legs cool down, and it gives a chance for them to relax. So, like, if you just stop running immediately and you don't cool down. Uh, your legs will be a lot more sore and that's what I figured out with so many you know miles of running um, that you want to have a cool down after your run you want to walk you want to you know let your legs um, get a chance to cool down you don't want to just stop them immediately you know you always want to have a cool down so you know that's another thing that I do after my runs I'll go on a walk um, just think to myself uh, this is some nice, you know, peaceful music, you know, and just chill. This walk right here is really just my chill spot, you know. We just chilling right now, y'all. We just chilling. So I'm just going to enjoy it. Uh, yeah, y'all. I've been enjoying this walk, and uh, I'll see y'all back at the Cribbo. All right, guys. I know my three mile, um, so what I'll do after my three mile, I'm in the bathroom right now. What I'll do after three mile is I'll do toe touches and then I'll sit on my butt and then do toe touches again. And then I'll do uh, <clears throat> left and right toe touches. So one a toe touch on each foot. And then I'll do calf stretches and I'll stretch my foot. And um, I'll just, all right guys. I just got done with stretching. Um, now I'll take a shower and I'll eat breakfast. So, yeah, on to taking a shower. See you guys when I get out. All right, y'all, just got out the shower. Um, feeling good, feeling great. Um, it's almost 8 o'clock now. My class starts at 8 o'clock, so I got to go get signed in right now in my class. And I'll make breakfast and go back to class and... Um, you know, class one, do like a mini workout. I do a mini workout in between every single uh, every single class. So I really never stop working out, to be honest with you guys. I never stop working. I have a bag inside of the room that I am um, doing my class in. So I, I'll even hit the bag while I'm, I'm in between my classes. So I never stop working, y'all. The key is never stop working. Never stop working, y'all. But yeah, I'm gonna get logged into this class, you guys, and then make breakfast, and I'll show you guys what I eat for breakfast. Okay, guys, peace. All right, guys, I'm still in class right now, filling out some sex questions. Oh, I gotta actually do uh, my class, my schoolwork right now, you guys. I will show you my breakfast in a second. All right, guys, got done with my first class. I'm going to show you guys my breakfast, how I make it, and stuff like that, and then I will do my mini workout. Yeah, I didn't have breakfast till the end of my class. It just happens sometimes, you know. It's just showing a day in the life of me, you know. It's realistic. So, we're going to go over. No, we're not. I'm going to stay in the room. Um, I'm going to show you guys how I make my breakfast and do this little mini workout. So, yeah. Uh, let me show you guys how to do it. Alright guys, I'm going to show you how to make my breakfast and this is how I eat every single morning. I'm very consistent with this breakfast because it's honestly not bad and it is really easy to make and um, it's just per it has the perfect macros for me and how I work out. It's also a very good breakfast if you're trying to be healthy and you're trying to lose weight. So it's a very good breakfast for losing weight. That is another thing that I love it for is when I'm cutting weight, I can eat this every time. Even even when I'm not cutting weight, I eat this. Like It's just an amazing breakfast. So yeah, you guys, let me get on with 
let me get on with how to make my breakfast. All right, guys. So this is how I make my breakfast every single morning. So take some protein powder. I'm gonna be using uh, vanilla protein powder. I like. I feel like it's a better taste with oatmeal than chocolate. 100%. Um, oh my gosh, it's way too much, you guys. It's way too much. Gotta take some out. That is way too much, you guys. Way too much. And also matters what type of protein you have. This is a very like dense protein, so it's it's gonna you're you're gonna see this. Y'all think it's a little bit, but it's a lot. Like look, look, look how it just there's so much inside of it already. Like, and one scoop would be um. 13 grams of protein. This is a more of a low calorie, light protein, but this its texture is dense. So it's, it's just really weird. I don't know. I can't really understand why, but yeah. So I put uh, one scoop of protein in there, a half a scoop, more, 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 more like a half a scoop. We'll put a half, half, like half a scoop. Then I'll put um, a little bit more than half of a banana in there. Like, like that much. Boom, put it in there. What I'll do is I'll take my spoon and I will chop it up like this, like so. Okay, mix that up a little bit. Um, then I'll take cinnamon and just put a little bit. Remember guys, I cannot stress enough just a little bit because cinnamon goes a long way. It's one of those uh, spices where, man, you use it and you just need to put a little bit on it because it's so strong and it just, man, it'll last you a long way. So make sure you guys just, just a little bit. Got to focus on this cinnamon right now. Uh, that's enough. It's literally just that much. Oh, got to focus. How long has it been out of focus, you guys? Oh my gosh, if it's out of focus that whole time, oh, I'll be so mad. Oh my gosh, I'll be so mad. But that is how you make my breakfast. Also got a coffee over here. It's how you make my breakfast. Just stir it up. It smells amazing, actually. It actually smells so good, guys. I am going to be eating this, and I'll see you guys after I'm done eating this. All right, guys. Also, you guys, I'll be taking my vitamins. I have calcium and D, uh, vitamin D. I have elderberry, zinc, and vitamin C in here. And I have a multivitamin filled right here, which is vitamin A, vitamin C, vitamin B, vitamin D. Uh, a lot of freaking vitamins in this multivitamin. And it has other stuff um, for performance and things like that throughout the day. It is more of a performance, like athlete multivitamin, but you know, that's who I am. So <laughs> that's what I get. Um, but yeah, I'll be taking this with my meal. So yeah, guys, I'll see you after I eat my meal, take my vitamins and drink my coffee. And then I'll do my mini workout, um, get on my mini workout, then uh, get ready for my next class. Then after that class, I have a break in a rest session. And then after that, um, I get I finish school and then get on to my second and third session. Sometimes I only have a second, but we're probably gonna go for a second and third today. And then after that, we wrap it up and we do schoolwork and things like that. But yeah, and we, we, you guys will see later on, later throughout the video what's gonna happen. I'm not trying to spoil the whole video right now, but yeah. See you guys then. I'll see you guys during this time I'm eating my food. I watch a lot of boxing. You guys, I watch so much boxing, I watch so much film that it's just crazy. I know so many boxers. So this is another way how I get in my boxing training. This is training. Watching film is training. Remember guys, watching your film of your craft is training. You're training your brain how to do it better the next time. And you're watching the best do it the best way. So um, it's, it's also training. So I'm getting my, uh, my film in um, while I'm eating. So that's a, also another great way to uh, train is to get your film in while you're eating. So yeah, guys, just sitting here watching boxing. Just want to let you guys know I'm also training while I'm eating. All right, guys, I just got done with my breakfast. I did. My, I took my vitamins and got done with my coffee. So now I'm going to do a mini workout. 
And these workouts are about five to 10 minutes. It's nothing crazy. We don't do nothing like crazy, crazy. It's just to get um, my blood pumping so I don't stay too tired uh, around the clock. And also just to stay active. You know, I like to just, you know, stay, stay active. So, yeah. All right, let's get on right to it. First, we'll start with push-ups. And then we'll move on to dips. And then we'll move on to... Uh, we'll do sit-ups. I guess we'll do sit-ups, so, yeah, let's get on to it. We're gonna do a little bit of sit-ups, not sit-ups, but crunches and uh, uh, reaches. Where well, uh, I'll show you guys how to reach. Um, it's my favorite ab workout out of all of them. It's to do reaches. So sit down here, and then we'll reach, we'll reach, and we're not gonna go all the way up. We're not gonna go all the way up. We're gonna go halfway, not even halfway. We're just reaching. Like this, and you'll do it about 50 to 100 times. Staying active, y'all. Just staying active. I don't know why I'm so tired right now, guys. Super tired right now, you guys. I am super tired. Wait, I stopped my boxing goal? What? About five minutes. I was about five minutes, you guys. Just getting a little bit active, just moving moving our body just to stay, stay moving, to keep the blood pumping so I really don't get tired, but... Yeah, guys, Whew. I don't know why I was so tired right there. I don't, I don't, I don't understand that, but don't the first workout. My next class is in about an hour or two. No, an hour. My next class is in an hour. And after that class, we'll do a, a probably a smaller workout and then go rest. We're resting till the next class. And then uh, I have two more classes after that, and then I'll start doing my actual uh second session in my third session so yeah guys see you then hey y'all what's up what's up bon Scott, with how y'all doing yeah yeah god bless y'all in the mighty name of jesus christ i hope everything is going well for y'all out there now y'all heard her man y'all heard her we just over here we walk into the mailbox me and my mom you know yeah. she said she wanted to walk to the mailbox so I was like, hey we can get some minutes out of this right mom that's right Get the minutes, get, get the em. minutes, you know. <laughs> We're just over here walking, y'all know. I'm over here with these tired eyes because mom already know every time I run in the morning, I get tired for the rest of the day. Hold it right now. But yeah, I'm holding it right. I'm holding hold it on, right. Let's stop for a minute. Let's stop for a minute. I appreciate all the love y'all give my babies Brent, Chloe, you know, Jordan, Cameron. 
God bless you guys in the mighty name of Jesus. I hope everything is going well for you guys because I know it's hard out here. Amen. You know what I'm saying? I know it's hard out here. We all just trying to make it out here. You know what I'm saying? So I hope the best for all of you. You know, God is good. Hold on to him because he will get you through. Amen. Amen. God bless you. Amen. All right, y'all. We just going on. And, and, and also, Xavier, too. Y'all be y'all be talking about Xavier heavy, man. I've been seeing. Oh, man. Xavier's got some music coming. That was a big old dang bird. But uh, <laughs> That's my baby, Xavier. He got some music coming for y'all. He got some good music. Coming. Hey, y'all heard? Y'all heard it? Y'all heard it? <laughs> My children are very talented. I'm so proud of all of Amen. them. Amen. The Lord bless you with children. You know, that's a blessing. It's a blessing. I love my babies and I support them 100%. God bless y'all in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. We don't get the talent from no nowhere now. You know what I'm saying? I get the power and speed, you know, from my mama, you know. That's that shy rack, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> well, you know, I get that pop and that speed from my mama, you know. And that athleticism, you know, I get that from my mom. You know, I get, I get, I get most of my power from my dad, but the athleticism and the movement and the speed, y'all know, y'all yeah. be talking about that speed, man. I get that from my mom, you know, yeah, like that I used speed, to be real fast, you know, I used to quickness. run track, play basketball, you know, I did a couple, couple things, you know what I'm saying? I did it all, but hey, so we're going to get to this mailbox, you know, all right, God bless y'all. God bless y'all. Love y'all. See y'all soon. All right, then. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, guys, I'm headed into my next class. Um... And this one is consumer math. So I'll do this class, and as soon as I get done, I'll do a small workout. And then, as you guys, as I told you guys, it is time to rest. And then is my next workout, and then I'll wrap up the whole day after that. But yeah, see you guys after class. All right, y'all. Uh, how you got doing my class? All right, y'all, just got done with my class. I'm going to do another little mini workout. I don't even want to call it a workout. I want to call it just moving. I'm going to move, you know, get my get my blood pumping. So, you know, we're going to be over here. We just put a shadow box, you know, for a couple minutes. I'm going to put on my boxing thing. Put a like, shadow box for like five minutes. Something light, you know. But nothing crazy, you know. Ooh, 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 boom, 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 Y'all see me?
Just trying new things, y'all. Oh, that's that's three minutes. Just do a round of shadow boxing. Some light, some small. Y'all know. Easy work. Ah, right, y'all. <laughs> All right, y'all. Finish up the activity. Now it's time for uh rest. I'm probably gonna eat a little something. If I do eat a little something, I will record it. But if I don't eat, I won't record it. But yes, you guys, done with the activity, on to the rest and eat, then rest. We're gonna see if we eat, but you know, realistic day. All right, so see you guys then. Made me food and I'm very thankful. Um, look at this. Y'all, come on now. Come on.